and in lane eight, rounding out the field, it's Hastings. It's important to remember that you can totally switch your relay team between trials and finals. If you wanted to, you could have four different swimmers. The state record was set back in 1992 by Ralston High School of Hope Time with a time of 136.26. Of course, lane three is at the top of your screen, lane eight down at the bottom. Ooh, that was a nice start. Good lead there in lane six. Well, and Matt, in lane six, Scott, uh, Scott's Bluff, excuse me, in lane six, Millard North, B Bill Brown, he's underwater so long, and yet he comes out up top. Some of these backstrokers, they have such strong lower body that they feel they're much quicker underwater. Well, your leaders after the backstroke leg in lane number six, that's Millard North swimming breaststroke. It's Clark Youngman for Millard North. Very close in lane eight. That's Hastings' John Melnick. Well, you know, Millard North is hanging on. It's nice to get a lead off of that backstroke leg. You get clean open water, as I said before. Let's watch on these exchanges. You can see what a difference a, late, a lead makes as far as swimmers diving in the water. Well, coming up in lane number seven, that's Kyle Dunlap for Omaha Creighton Prep. In the water for Millard North, it's Jason Begel. And in lane eight for Hastings, it's Dallison Lorenz. Well, gosh, with a lead like that, you just got to believe that Millard North wants to make a run here. Well, Millard North with 50 yards to goal has Cole Hinevin in the water, but coming up in three, it's in five, it's Omaha Westside, and in lane four, it's Millard West. What a great finish. Watch lane four. He's going to go after it. We're Ray coming I down to 10 yards, and it's too close to call. Nice finish. And your winner with a time of 138.20 in lane four, that's Millard West. Well, you know, Tracy Stauffer told me yesterday, the coach at Millard West, that, that he felt they had a lot of room to improve today. Hey, there's the relay that proved it right there. Look at the finish. Their freestyler was hungry, stayed right in the middle of the lane. He can see lane six, and at the finish, just edged him out. Well, what a, what a great finish by Trent Robertson.